So the name Zed came about because my last name starts with a Z, and I grew up in Germany. And in Germany, it's not a Z, it's a Z. The whole electronic music project for me was just a hobby. I didn't even release my first album. I just gave it to my friends to listen to. And just so they know what it is, we're like, we'll just call it Z. It's fine, I don't care. It's not that important. <laughs> What's up, GQ? My name is Zed. I travel a lot, so I have a lot of essentials. And here they are. I don't actually know exactly what the model is. I know they're Adidas. But the most important thing is the sole and that they're very comfortable. I jump on stage for 90 to 120 minutes a day and wearing uncomfortable shoes is really bad. I like the look of them. Most of the times people can't really see it because my feet are covered anyway, but it's a nice bonus when, when they look nice. I have way too many pairs of sneakers. So I bought a house and it has two closets. I have my closet for my clothes and I turned the other one to a shoe closet. I decided for myself then as soon as it's completely full, uh, I'm gonna, s I'm still gonna get more shoes, but I'm gonna replace them. And then I'm gonna give the ones that I replace away. A portable battery. I don't know why I'm so obsessed with these, because um, obviously I could just regularly charge my phone, but I think sometimes on the plane, you don't have another way of charging a phone. I just like the thought that I'm covered if I need it. I sometimes get into trouble because I guess these things are considered dangerous. When you fly, they will look at like, oh, how much, how much, oh, this is 20,000, okay, is that all you have? And it's like, no, I got five more. <laughs> I, at some point, had like eight, and I remember we were in China, and you're only allowed to carry a certain amount. So it was literally a matter of, you can take two, I'll take this one, you take that one, splitting it between my entire team. My next essential is sweatpants with zippers. The zipper is the crucial part for me. I fly, in sweatpants every single day. I can't wear jeans on the plane. And I have nightmares of waking up and my phone not being in my pocket. So I got these sweatpants that are super comfy, but they didn't have a zipper. So I added a zipper. So now I can use them on the plane. It's quick and easy, and uh, it will save you from waking up on the plane in panic mode. My next essential, sunglasses. I feel like that's an essential for almost everybody in the world. I always wear the same pair of sunglasses and I also don't lose them. These ones, I believe these are the Erica's. Gives me a little bit of throwback vibes. I don't know what we're throwing back to, but uh, I like them. They're simple, they're super light. They look good on anyone, by the way. Black sunglasses just always work. They're never out of place, no matter what you wear. Put them on and it works. The phone is kind of obvious. I think that's an essential for everybody nowadays. The wallet sticker, whatever you want to call it, on the back of my phone. I think like three or four years ago, someone from my team got this and put in their you know, credit card and ID and stopped carrying a wallet. And to me, I have always had a huge wallet with a million cards, cash, different currencies, anything you can imagine. And I decided to just give it a try. So I figured what is the really most important thing that I actually use every day? My credit card, an alternative credit card for when people don't take Amex, my driver's license, and my hotel key. So those are honestly the only four things I ever need. And I don't have a wallet and I haven't had a wallet in probably four years now. I've never been in a situation where I'm like, oh, I wish I had my wallet because I don't need it. Another essential for me are earplugs. These are custom-made earplugs by ACS. I mean, I'm on stage for a living, so I need to protect my ears. These earplugs that have a little hole in the back, you can exchange the filter. For example, you go to some place, a bar, and it's a little bit loud, you can put a 6 dB filter in, so it's just gonna make it a little bit quieter. You go to a really loud concert, you can put in other filters that are gonna make it much quieter. A lot of people don't wanna wear earplugs because it kind of makes the sound worse at a show. It's muffled, it kills all the highs. These don't, these just keep the exact same sound it is and just makes it quieter because you can't feel them. They're custom made for your ear, so they basically put wax kind of thing in your ear. Or nowadays is to uh, do a 3D laser scan of your ear and then they print them out. Have earplugs, protect your ears, very important. You're not gonna get them back. My next essential is maybe boring for most people, but really essential for me. These two keys, this is my life. This is my license keys to uh, the software I use to produce music, which is Cubase. And then this key for all my plugins, all the sounds I use, um, they're all on this key. And thanks to Apple for removing my USBs, I need to put these in here. And then, thank you Apple, I can't put this in my new MacBook anymore because they took them from me, so I need a adapter. And then I can put that into my laptop. 
Yeah, Apple. When you have a lot of essentials in your life, you need a place to put them. For me, it's a Tumi backpack. It's actually pretty simple. It actually is a kind of a small backpack, but it fits a lot of things. This one is really good. It has a pocket that's perfect for passports. It has a pocket here that I have my keys in, an Advil for the nights of alcohol. Back pocket for your laptop. And I would highly recommend it if you are a person like me that likes to have things in dedicated places. And if you don't need a ton of space for, I don't know, what you travel with. If you just have small stuff that you want to carry in 45 battery packs like that, then this is a good choice. Tissues. I use a brand called Tempo. They're German, I think. And they are very soft, but very strong. I find Kleenex to be super soft, but not very strong. But I'm pretty allergic to a lot of things that grow in the spring and summer. So I need tissues with me always, especially if I travel to Europe. It's really bad. Or if I decide to cry because I'm really sad, it's also really good for that. I don't know if you can get them in America, to be honest with you. I have a lifetime supply at home, so I will never run out of tempos. My cologne. I wear Chanel Allure. Bomb. I've been using the same cologne since I was maybe 17, 16, 17. I'm so used to it that I can't smell it myself anymore. I think whatever in my nose is dead after using this for so long. But people always say that I smell nice and this is the reason, it's not me, it's that. Uh, what's your application method? Do you spray in the air and walk into it or do you spray on your... Wrist? Is that a thing? Yeah. I start here and do... But not full ones. I guess I could just do two like normal people do. But I, I guess I feel really extra when I use this. So I do... This is, we call it hand banana, but it's a neck pillow. I've been using this for a long time. As you guys probably know, by now I have a very specific taste and I stick to the things I like. It has the option to basically straighten it out and you can put it, you know, as a pillow for your lower back. And then my dear hand banana has the feature of tightening it. And my secret travel way is making this as tight as possible. It gets relatively hard. Window seat is something that's essential, but I couldn't bring it with me. So just bear that in mind. And then this side leans to the window and it's magic. Once I was skydiving, I had a window seat and on the way up, I was just kind of like, until I realized I have to jump out of a plane. <laughs> My next essential is a laptop charger. I personally use the new MacBook and they only have USB-C. So this was a Kickstarter that I found. This side has the USB-C that you put into your phone, but you also have the three USBs that Apple stole from your life. You get them back. I use the same charger for both my iPhone and my laptop. Um, and if you need to plug in a USB key to, I don't know, for music or for whatever, you can also use this. And it's the exact same size as your regular Apple charger, but you can also hide the cable in here. It's got like a little pocket, so it actually becomes even smaller. And you can detach this, so it just becomes a little, little cube. I'm scared of buying I, I am too, because I've bought things that I never received. So if you see this, and you've been one of those, send it to me. <laughs>